never, ever, 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 ever come against a child of God. Never, ever, 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 ever tell a child of God when they're telling you to repent, to get right with God. Don't ever tell them that we're acting like God or acting like Christ. No, that's the Holy Spirit speaking through us to repent, condemning you for your wrongs. Do not ever come against a child of God because that will be extremely bad on your part. We're helping you get close to God and for you to act right. Don't sit there and tell us, well, don't be telling me to repent. Who are you? You're not God. You're not this. You're not holy. You know what? That is your problem. You're not close to God. That is going to hurt you. If you don't want to repent, that's fine. We can lead the horse to water, but we sure in the heck can't make you drink. But that's fine. That's when we walk away and say, you know what, God, this is between you and them. But I'm going to tell you this right here, right now. I know God is very particular about his children, the chosen ones. If we say we're chosen, we're chosen. Okay? God says it. I know God has enlisted me in his army for many things he has me do just to show me and to tell me. Long story. The point is... I know God does certain things with all of his children, all of his chosen ones, and he sticks up for us and and he fights our battles and everything. But for myself, as an example, being renamed Hephzibah, he delights himself in her. When my father states the fact, if you toy with my daughter's heart, Hephzibah's heart, you are going after the apple of my very own eye. And let's put it that this way. God has made himself very well known that he's deadly. He will go after whomever is closest to that person and sucks the life clean out of them. And he'll tell you, You let them know that was a warning. If they don't repent, there's a wrath without mercy. There's been quite a few people who have judged me wrongly. Whether I heard it or not. Whether I've cried, was hurt in my heart, or angered me. It does not matter. God doesn't play. God doesn't hesitate on any of it. He has taken loved ones from them, whomever is closest to their heart, whose death would hurt them the most. And he will tell you, as he has told me, that's just a warning. Get them to repent, or the wrath is without mercy. And none of them repented. And they're all going through a hellish wrath. I'm not trying to be like God, nor do I claim to be God, nor do I want to be God. Do I want to be close to God and follow God and worship God and obey God? Oh, yes, without a shadow of a doubt. But never do I try to be like God. If I tell you to repent, it's because I'm trying to help you to get closer to God. I'm not trying to be God. And see, that's what's wrong with the world is lukewarm or wannabe Christians. Okay, you read your Bible once or twice a day. Good for you. Satan knows the Bible inside and out. If you're not walking in righteousness, if you're not repenting daily, if you are not walking in straight obedience, if you're not fasting, if you're not staying drowned in his word, if you're not preaching the gospel, if you're not giving your tithe and sowing your seed, you are not going to heaven. Those are the things that will get you into the gates of heaven. All of that has to be followed one by one. Every day. Every single day. 
you didn't catch them all, play this video again. They all have to be carried out every day. The fasting could be a couple of times a week. It does not have to be on a daily basis because you'll become weak and easy for Satan to attack. But don't come against the child of God. Don't judge a child of God, especially the chosen ones. Don't. It can be very harmful to you. Just remember that. We're not the ones you ever want to come against. We have a father that will suck the life clean out of you just as quick as he breathed it into you. And we have an entire army that is the most deadliest army ever known to man. And that's heaven's army. Don't ever come against a child of God. You'll only get hurt.